All righty. Let's take a gander. Was not received well at all. Look at that. It's Jalaza. That was a nice one. Okay. I'm out here. Uh-oh. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, man. Bam. Oh, wow. Wow. Will Smith just smacked the shit out of me. I think, see right here, this is, oh, this right here is just uncomfortable. Like, you can feel it. I feel as if he just slapped him, walked away, sat down, no issue. But the fact that he did this. And you can see the intensity in his face. Like, look how, look at the intensity in his face right here. Bro, he ain't about play play right now. Like, he is serious. And these moments are always awkward for me. So even seeing as I had to, like, pause it or walk away just because the, the, the awkwardness in the air, you can just feel it. It just feels oh, like, oh, my God, this is so weird. Just those weird moments, man. But let's, uh, let's, let's uh, keep going. Wow, dude. It was a G.I. Jane joke. Name out, out your fucking mouth. Woo! Okay. Uh, uh, okay. It's awkward. It's awkward. It's awkward. Okay. For me, it's only awkward. You know, but here's what I'll say. Uh, salute to Chris Rock for being able to just take that remain in composure and keep it moving you know now with that said uh, i kind of have mixed feelings on this because i think it's sucky that it had, had this situation had to happen with two of these icons two legendary icons in their field as far as music acting you know com uh, comedy and you know just being excellent at everything that they do you know it sucks it had to be those two but on the other hand i look at it for exactly what it is a man is defending the honor of his wife and regardless how you f if you think that he's a comedian and um you know you should be able to just take a joke Okay, maybe you could say that. But if someone personal, personally close to me came out and expressed something as far as, you know, alopecia and a joke is being made about it and she does not find it funny, I will find offense to it. Period, point blank. And I see a lot of people, they give their reaction to it or they give their opinion about the situation and they speak on the August Alcina situation. And the thing we have to realize as viewers is the news to us will get back to us way later than a situation has already occurred. So while the news or while people are reacting to the August Alcina situation, Will Smith and Jada, they have already personally handled the situation. It's already been handled months and months prior to this even being public knowledge and so they're over this so i don't like when people like to compare and bring up this situation it's like oh he can slap chris rock but he's letting the man run up and through his house and go through his wife two completely two completely different situations and different scenarios and in this particular instance i feel as if will smith was justified in his reaction not necessarily his actions as far as like slapping, but doing something that will let you know, like, this isn't OK and I'm not OK with this. And I saw this and I kind of had a similar reaction to other people um, as far as like Will Smith laughing it off. And then, you know, Jada Pink and she's not laughing at all as far as he, he looks over and probably sees his wife not laughing and then he gets up there and has to you know defend his wife but here's the other way to look at it because in i'm speaking from personal experience as far as when i when there's situations that 
I don't necessarily like or that I'm not comfortable with, sometimes I'll laugh. Like sometimes I will laugh. You're laughing about the situation, but you do not think it's funny. And a lot of people go through this in life. You know, for instance, when I was growing up in high school, people used to get roasted. I know there's sometimes when I get roasted and I might take it in a personal way, but I'll just laugh it off. So just because someone's laughing, it does not mean that what they're laughing at is funny to them. And in this instance, he did not feel that it was funny for his wife to be made a butt of a joke. And I know that being a, a uh, speaking from a, com a, a comedian's point of view, just a joke. Hey, it's just a joke. But you are not the one that can tell me what is funny or what I find funny. And if you make a personal shot or take a personal shot at someone that I love, you take the risk of getting slapped. And that's what it is. Sucks it had to be those two. But that's just the reality of the situation. Any other situation outside of this, there's no point of comparing because it has nothing to do with the other, you know. Um, and even if it's, the, and you know, the funny thing is, it's when someone makes a joke that offends or hurts someone that you care about, it's even more impactful if it was a shot taken to you personally. Because I know I'm, I'm very sensitive when it comes to my friends and my family and people that I care about. So if I feel that they are, you know, they, they feel like a personal shot or if they take offense to something, I get more offended than if it was me. You know, like being in the social media atmosphere and, you know, being in the health field, I see a lot of people come at my close friend and I get offended by that. And I would want to take up arms and do things to, you know, protect him or defend his honor because I understand his intentions and stuff like that. But I can see how you can take that a little bit more personal and, you know, react that way. So I'm on both sides of the fence. Like, while I do understand, you know, it's comedy, it's just a joke and, you know, you should be able to laugh at some of that stuff. You cannot tell someone how they should react when someone that they love has came out in public forums to express her pain and her struggle with going through alopecia and you make a joke about it and think it was funny you know i don't i don't think that's that's necessary and you also have to think about it like this 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 was presented on the night that will smith had won his oscar and i didn't watch the oscar so i'm not sure of the order in which it happened but based on the clips it seems as if it happened right before uh, he got the the Oscar win. Maybe it didn't. I'm not sure. I didn't see the Oscars. But the night that it's being highlighted, you didn't you didn't need to bring up you didn't need to bring up Jada Pinkett Smith at all. You, she didn't need to have to be the butt of a joke at all. And I get it's just a joke once again, but she did not need to be that joke. But let me know your thoughts about this. I'm curious to get everyone's insight about this because this it's all around sucky situation. Regardless of the situation, regardless if you're at an Oscar, Grammy, whatever award show you're at, if you say something that may offend me or someone that I care about, you have the responsibility of having to face those repercussions. That's just what it is. Let me know your thoughts about this. How do you feel about the situation that's not compared to an August Alcina situation? Because this has nothing to do with it. This situation by itself is its situation by itself. So that's, that's the respect that I feel it should be granted. So let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. I don't really like negative situations, but everyone in their mama's talking about this. So I'm just going to offer my three cents. I will see you beautiful people later. Make sure y'all subscribe to the channel and I will see you all next time. Holla. I'm just kicking it, just kicking it, just kicking it, just kicking it.